Well, she's an accomplished actor, and you might recognize her from such hits as Ally McBeal, King of the Hill, in movies like Keeping the Faith, What Women Want, and Daddy Daycare. This morning, Lisa Edelstein is here with us to talk about her role as Dr. Lisa Cuddy on the hit Fox show House. Good morning to you. Good morning. All right. First of all, let's, let's talk right about your character. Let's get right into that, because it's such a strong character, and she kind of has to be, because she has to deal with House on a regular basis. That's right, and I think in this episode you get to understand what else she has to deal with uh, and, and him at the same time. So it's, uh, it's, it adds interesting layers to the tell story. Us a little bit, tell us a little bit about the episode, because it's going to be, uh, we're going to get to see it from a completely different view. Yeah. Yeah, in the same way you did with the Wilson episode, this, if, if you watch, this is um, uh, from Cuddy's POV, and um, it starts right with her at the beginning of the day and travels through her day, and it happens to be a very difficult day for her. Um, but what's really nice is to kind of see how the rest of the world that you normally see just kind of weaves in and out of her world. Well, you've played a lot of different characters uh, throughout your career, some very uh, characters that are out of the norm. What do you love about yeah. playing uh, Dr. Cuddy? Uh, well, it's incredible to play a character for this long and to really get to get, go deeper and deeper with, with, uh, with a make-believe person. <laughs> um, I've had an incredible time working with David Shore and all the writers on House. They're, they're so talented. So definitely it's a unique experience for me in that way. Um, I love playing weird people, too. Cuddy's not very weird, but um, she's certainly, I've certainly got to explore her on a deeper level. Well, you've played and in this episode, it, I gets, it gets quite deep. I had to, in fact do some scenes without any clothes on, which was very embarrassing after six years. Yeah, that could um, be. Yes. All right, so you've, you've worked with some uh, pretty well-known leading men with uh, some very strong personalities. Talk about working with Hugh Laurie. What's that like? Uh, he's a great guy. He, he worked so hard, and um, it means so much to him for something to be exactly right, that um, it, it forces everybody else to work with as much integrity as possible. Um, he's a great guy, and he actually got to direct his first episode recently. And uh, seeing him on on the other side of the camera was was really exciting because it was so nice for him to have a change of pace and be able to really um, be creative in a in a different way. Uh, and uh, he was wonderful at it. So he's a multi talented guy. This uh, this ride that you guys have been on from the time from the very first episode to now, it's become a little bit of a. Uh, TV phenomenon. I mean, this is a big time show. It's it's uh, really exciting. I, I, it's not something that you can necessarily plan for in your life when you're an actor, but it's certainly something you hope will happen. It's okay. not just a really popular show, but uh, it's a it's a really good show. So it's not embarrassing. Okay, a lot <laughs> it's really of really easy to be embarrassed on a worldwide level in this business. <laughs> Absolutely, a lot of Fox shows, uh, TV shows, end up becoming a big time Hollywood movie. When do we get to see House? The movie. <laughs> I'm not sure. That would be really interesting if that happened. It could be a good movie. It could get pretty high tech. Yeah, I, I could see it. I'd definitely pay money to see it. I want to know what goes on for an hour and a half between you guys. <laughs> I think we could, we could really get down and dirty if we had that much time. Okay, so obviously Fox uh, airs the show uh, on Monday yeah. nights, and we have a, a, a really cool episode uh, to look forward to. Uh, Lisa Edelstein, Thanks. thank you for taking the time. Good luck with the show. And I want to say hi to my little nieces, Larissa and Ella, who live in Houston. All right, there you go. Houston Tide. Thank you so much for being with us. <laughs>